Hi everyone, it's Mike here. Welcome back to another beaver video. Today's video all took place on one evening in late May, and all of these clips are filmed on the same large rock that is near the dock for the Prairie Lily Riverboat in Saskatoon. Beavers mark their territory by making scent mounds, and the beavers I follow often make their scent mounds on top of large rocks along the edge of the river. They make their scent mounds by putting mud and debris on top of a rock and then spraying their scent on it. Their scent is a mixture of castorium and their urine. Sometimes beavers will remark the same spot over and over. In the clip that just ended, you saw a beaver that we call Palmer that has a notch in its tail hop up on a large rock. There already was quite a bit of dried mud and debris on top of that rock because beavers had been marking that rock over the past several days and and Palmer went up there and sniffed around and, and likely sprayed her own scent. It looks like she sprayed her scent just as she got up on the rock. Anyways, about 10 minutes later another beaver came along and as you can see watching the clip that beaver was very very interested in the smells on the rock. So this second beaver that came along actually didn't get up on the rock. You'll see shortly he puts a little mud up there, or she, I mean, I have no idea if it's a male or female, but didn't actually go up and spray its scent. Scientists think that the scent the beavers leave behind conveys more than just marking territory, but also can convey, convey information like the sex of the beaver, how old it is, and maybe whether it's looking for a mate. So here, about 15 minutes later, a third beaver came along. This beaver also was very interested in the scents. When beavers are uh, two years old, their instinct tells them to head out and look for a mate and find their own territory. And so often in the summertime, there are a lot of two-year-olds on the move looking for mates. Some of the beavers in this video look like they might be two years old, and I wonder if a lot of this sniffing and scent marking is actually looking for a mate. I, I really don't know for sure. This is actually the same beaver, the third one. I stopped the video because I thought that beaver had swam away, and then suddenly I realized it had hopped back up on the rock and was uh, leaving its scent. So this is the same beaver as from the previous clip. His tail kind of blocks the spray, but he definitely left his scent there. I don't know why I say he or she about these beavers. You can't tell a male beaver from a female beaver just by looking at them from the outside unless you see a nursing female. So I have no idea whether any of these beavers are male or female. This is the fourth beaver that came along quite shortly after. This beaver uh, stopped for a sniff, but something on the path or movement or sound spooked him because he didn't stay very long. And now this was another 10 or 15 minutes later. A fifth beaver came along. This beaver, as you can see, has a whole bunch of mud and sticks, um, hops up there to leave its scent. So anyways, this was a very busy rock. I don't know if it was just territory marking or whether this, these are beavers looking for a mate, but it sure was a lot of fun to see so many beavers visit the exact same rock. That was the last clip. I know a lot of my followers like to watch these videos without my narration, so now I'm gonna replay all five or six clips without me talking. So I'll stop talking now, and I hope you enjoy the videos. Cheers.